Now to the latest on that horrible accident in Robstown. As we've reported, a total of six people were killed, all men and all believed to be undocumented immigrants. And we're told at least five others remain in the hospital tonight. Our Madeline Dart has the update for us, including word that the city of Robstown has brought in grief counselors for their first responders. It is once again our top story. Now that was such a horrible scene and the Robstown City Department says that their first responders are going through grief counseling and here's what one psychiatrist has to say about seeing that horrible trauma. It's a harsh sight for the people who are first on the scene. Psychiatric nurse Jessica Wilson says even our heroes are affected by trauma. It can affect everybody a different way, um, but and sometimes the reactions are delayed. Wilson says it can take nearly 90 days for the average person to process trauma, but for people like first responders who don't have time to react, the effects can lead to PTSD. Nightmares, intrusive thoughts, having flashbacks of what happened, avoiding things. We would maybe then consider, is this post-traumatic stress disorder? in which case you would really want to go seek some help. The crash in Robstown happening not even a year after a shooting that killed five people in their town. Wilson says it helps to have grief counselors available as soon as possible because even our heroes need time to grieve. They're there for everybody to take care of us all and they don't want to be um, maybe weak or feel like they're not handling it well, but seeking help doesn't mean you're not handling it. It just, you know, it's a little push. It's just a little hug along the way, and everybody deserves one. As this investigation continues, there are some details we are working together, and that's the identities of these individuals, if they had family here in Texas, and where they were headed. Of course, stay with 3 News for all the latest details on this case.